Hey guys, heading to Walmart for another grocery deal. Got my coupons in hand and got the kids all strapped in. I'm ready to go. Yeah. All right, we're here at Walmart. Peekaboo! <laughs> so I ended up getting a great deal and I got all of this for under $15. I ended up using coupons and rebates on everything except for the brisket in the middle. I'll give you the breakdown. The Tazo tea was free. This is one of my favorite kinds, the sweet cinnamon spice. It's like, it's the best. So Walmart had them for $3.28, I believe, and I price matched it to Sprouts, which was $3. And then I had a coupon for a dollar off and a rebate for $2 off, making it free. The Teddy Grounds were free. They were a dollar. And then there was a checkout 51 rebate that was a dollar off. So it was just a, a wash. It was free. The frozen garlic bread was only 13 cents after coupon and rebate. It was a dollar 88. And then I had a 50 cent coupon. And then I had multiple rebates from Ibotta and checkout 51. Looks yummy. It would go great with spaghetti. The Pillsbury dough was a great deal. I got all three for $1.50 with mixed coupons and rebates. So the biscuits were a dollar to start and then I did a 50 cent Ibotta rebate. The Crescents were $1.50 and they also had a 50 cent Ibotta rebate. The Pizza Crust was $2.48 and then there was a 50 cent Ibotta rebate. And then when you buy all three, there was a coupon that was a dollar off all three. And then there was also a separate rebate that was a dollar off all three, bringing them down to all three for a dollar fifty, which is pretty good. Got a great deal on the beans and hummus. It was forty two cents for all four of these right here. There were multiple rebates and coupons on this. So the hummus packets were a dollar sixty seven, and then I had a dollar off coupon, and then there was a fifty five cent rebate making these only 12 cents each. And the beans were 84 cents each with a 75 cent rebate from Checkout 51, making these only 9 cents each. Now these are pretty good and it's a much cheaper alternative to buying the pre-made hummus at the store. Both of these barbecue seasonings were free. They were $3.98 each and there was a $4 Ibotta rebate for both of them. Can't decide which one I'm going to use on the brisket. Yum. This coconut yogurt came out to 83 cents each, which is not too bad considering they started at $1.58 each. I used a coupon that was a dollar off two and then did an Ibotta rebate for 50 cents off. The silk yogurt turned out to be a money maker. I had a rebate and then I had a bonus rebate on top of that. It was $1.28 to start, and then I had a 50 cent off rebate. And then since this was the third time that I bought this, I got a dollar bonus rebate back, making this a 22 cent money maker. And the Tillamook yogurt turned out to be 41 cents each. They were, I believe, 54 cents, and then there was a 25 cent off rebate off two. Well, we eat tons of yogurt, so we're always buying yogurt, anything that's on a rebate, pretty much. I price matched the bananas at 33 cents a pound, so these were less than a dollar. This cucumber was a money maker. I price matched it to another market that was 16 cents each, and I had a 25 cent rebate from Checkout 51, so making it a 9 cent money maker. Their Bertoli sauce was $1.23 after a 75 cent I bought a rebate. Now this stuff's pretty good. I would recommend it. Most of their varieties are pretty good. And the Homestyle Ragu was $1.47 after rebate. Haven't tried this one, but it looks pretty good. The tomatoes were about 60 cents each after the 50 cent rebate on Ibotta. Can't have enough of these. We go through tons of canned tomatoes at our house. Got this whole blend shampoo for only 47 cents. So it started at 347 and then I had a dollar off coupon and a $2 off rebate. 
A brisket was on sale, two sixty six a pound, so six fifty four for this package. It's a great deal. I normally only buy brisket when it's under three dollars a pound, and then I'll buy a couple and stock up. So this was a great deal. I'm planning to cook this in the crock pot in the next couple of days with that new seasoning. I also had a few bonus Ibotta rebates that brought my total down $3 more. So keep an eye on those bonus rebates because you can get a pretty good deal, especially if you're just a few items short. It's worth it to do those bonus ones because you'll get everything else for free pretty much. Can't wait to drink this tea. It looks so good. Look at those ingredients. How could that not be good? Well, thanks for watching my video. I appreciate the views. Please like and subscribe. And if you have any questions or comments, please feel free to comment.